what is going on guys this is Goran the gamer and welcome back to another video yes I shaved my hair yes and the second of all yeah today we are gonna watch the difference between American and Canadian English so yeah because why not do a reaction like that one time huh hey so yeah we're gonna um, just roll off and we're gonna see how the difference are so yeah we have difference between America I think I know all the words in American and Canadian, but I'm Canadian, so yeah. I'm saying my words, how I would say. So yeah. Three, two, one, go. Hey, Chesterfield? It's Sounds like very a place. Chesterfield, Chesterfield, yeah, that's the sofa. It's very <laughs> That's the intro, though. Hi! Hi, I'm Christina from the USA. And I'm Sydney, and I'm from Canada. Yep, there she goes, Sydney. Canadians say A a lot. It a. Yeah. Depends, depends on, where. Yeah, it depends on the Canada. location, but yeah. yeah. Main, our yep. stereotype is saying A. Yeah, that's that's what I know. And also, like, the A sound is a little bit different. And I can't say, like, right or can something. Be, can be, depending on where, I'm sure. Yep. That's true. That's a pencil crayon. In the U.S. colored pencil. Yep. Pencil crayons. Pencil yeah. Crayons? Yeah. USA colored that. pencils. If we say crayon, it's just like a, a crayon. crayon. So but this pencil? is a pencil plus a crayon. Oh man, I didn't know that. That's uh, the first time I heard yeah, yeah. pencil crayon. Really? Like, yeah. I've never really heard. Color the color pencil, pencil makes sense too. Wow. <laughs> so it's just a pencil crayon. Uh, I'll be honest. That's Z. 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 Actually, other countries yes. say Z too. Yeah. Right? Is it you across Z? Europe, Z, Z all the time. Sure. Yeah, like, I don't know anymore too because I always thought Z coming from the US. Mm. But that so yeah, we Americans the hands are different. You see already, Z we say Z, not Z. <laughs> I think you the weird ones, America. I think, but yeah. And I heard other countries they yeah. say Z. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm not sure. If it's the UK. Different. Yeah. It might most likely is I just because it may be. the other places that you would hear English have been colonized by Britain. So. Right, right. That's a washroom. In America, we would say bathroom. In Canada, we say so, washroom. Yeah, I've heard. I've heard washroom. Yeah. Typically, yeah. Bathroom. Be right back and going to the bathroom. Bathroom is just like. In Canada, we. It is dirty, it's like for us, you know. That's what we call it, washroom. Yeah. So we use all these terms interchangeably. So yeah, that's, that's, that's right. That's right. We say bathroom sometimes too. Or might even say restroom. Right, right. Yeah, a restroom. Okay. Yeah, or two. It really depends on who you're speaking to. I think restroom is a public toilet though. Someone the bathroom is in the house. We'll in the house, I think. Yeah, so what do you use? I use these two most, like bathroom and washroom. But if I want to. I use a washroom. A bathroom sometimes too. To put this up, parkade. You would say parking lot. Uh, in Canada, it's uh, parkade. Yeah. Parkade. parkade, like a parking parade. Yes, we would say parkade. <laughs> Potentially, like this just makes more sense. Parkade, like here, or a parking lot. Parking lot is just one. Yeah, parking yep. lot is just one. one, and then parkade. Parking garage in America is hey up there. Okay, I've never heard that before. I guess it's a good idea too, but parkade, I would say. Parking parade, as most likely again from the UK. Yep. The UK. Nah, but the UK is so different too. Well, maybe. I think they say no. That's uh, so in the US, write a test for us. We, uh, yeah. Take a test. In Canada, we say we write a test. Take a test. test. Yeah, I'll write a test tomorrow. Oh, yeah, I write on the test. Yeah, I'm gonna take, take a test. Tomorrow. Never write. We say I say think say like I take have, like. I have a test tomorrow. Oh yeah, we would what? say I have a test as well, mm -hmm. or I'm going to take a test. Cool. Uh yeah, that's a little. That is the in runners. In the US, you would say sneakers. In Canada, ah. we say runners. Runners. Yeah. yeah. We would say runners a lot. Sneakers is also because a huge influence right. of America. We we'll yep. say sneakers, but yeah, runners are definitely very common. Yeah, runners. And shoes, exactly. And you run in runners. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That is this a pop. It would be called soda in the U.S. And that's mm, called soda. Pop. Mm, I know that. It yeah, we say pop. Where you live in the U.S. too, yeah. because there are some. Uh, yeah, they say Coke sometimes in the U.S. They say pop as well. Mm -hmm. Maybe or pops. And yeah, or pop. pop yeah. 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 Or yeah. Coke. Yeah. Pop soda, soda and pop. Yeah, it's used a little bit differently depending where you're from. Mm -hmm. But where yep. I'm from, we would say soda. We okay. Would never, like I've never heard yeah. anyone ever say pop. We yeah, say same pop. Coast. Same for me as I was pop. Never would we say soda. That's true. In the U.S., we would say. It is a Soviet. Paper napkin. For us. Okay. In Canada, oh, we would there. say we have two ways. We'll say it's either. But we say napkin too sometimes. Napkin. So it also depends on yeah. the area as well in Canada. Some areas. But Serviette is our real. Say 
Serviette. We, we are polite, well, you know. Others will say napkin a lot more. Is so that a French word? Uh, I think I think it's sounds, Yeah, it's that's a French, French word. word. Yeah, serviette. serviette. East, East Coast, East Side says Serviette a lot more. And then my, my side, the West Side, says more napkin. But if you heard Serviette, I'm, then you oh, would know what it know. is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I see Serviette. I was going to say, can I have a Serviette? Yeah. <laughs> serviette. That smokes or so like mean, cigarette, yeah, uh, so cigarettes. Is, uh, cigarette or like it smoke, yeah. ciggies. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Same. Like for us, we'll say smokes or cigarettes. So some of the smokes. Yeah. Say ciggies as well. Like, yeah. Like yeah. I said, like, as a ciggies is not that much in the U.S. or I think yeah. no. I've heard. I've heard some people say smokes in the U.S. Yeah, but, times, but yeah, it's maybe they're Canadian or. Yeah. Yeah. And it's a different, that, yeah, like, yeah, you know. Yeah. There's so many different ways to call it. That's a fire hall. So in the U.S., we would call this a fire yeah, station. Yeah, a fire station. Oh, we call yeah. it in Canada a fire hall or a fire station. Oh, fire hall. Yeah, Ooh. yeah, because okay, that's so maybe because it's like it's a big a, building. There's a yeah, hall. Yeah, there's a hall. So it's like a similar, hall, right? similar to like a hall. As she explains, okay. right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, I've always heard like fire hall or fire station. That's one okay, click. In the US, we would say for us. one kilometer. In Canada, we would say one kilometer as well. It will say oh. like a click. A click? Yeah, really? yeah, kilometer. Like, kilometer. Yeah, kilometer. But America is yeah. just miles, so not. Both. Click doesn't come to mind right away, but yeah, we do say it. Especially yeah. in. I know a lot of my friends in central Canada. Um, uh -huh. Because it's the prairies, so it's much flatter. I'm not near that. I'm near central Canada. Done there, so people will say click a lot. Like, yeah. It's a couple clicks away. Interesting. It's a couple clicks click away. Like, you know, click the mouse. Yeah. Click, click. So, like, one click is like. Yeah, for America, it's a click. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's yep. interesting. Yeah. Really cool. That's true. <laughs> That's a Chesterfield or yeah, a sofa. The US, we would call this a sofa. Or a couch. People will say a couch, or even sometimes people say a Chesterfield. And yeah, but then it's too British. Chesterfield is more British. It's I'm not using Chesterfield. British, but we'll say, um, really? I'm using it sometimes, yeah, but not that much. Or couch. Mm -mm -mm. couch. I'm sitting on the Chesterfield right now, so yeah, but. I think it's all three for us. But Chesterfield? Yeah. That's like, sounds it's like a very it's British. <laughs> it's very British. I'm gonna have She's British. right. Chesterfield, and then we'll have couch. And then couch. We'll have we say couch. I'm going to buy a Chesterfield and Chesterfield. <laughs> that's yeah, that's like what Americans think of us. Of like saying that shit. can be sort of different too compared to a couch. Okay. We love you, Americans. It's a town name. It could be, yeah. I maybe maybe really someone from Chesterfield, Chesterfield made the Chesterfield. Exactly. That's yeah, that's quite true. From the Chesterfields. Chesterfields. Could totally makes sense. We're having so fried chicken for a. We say a. We're having fried chicken for dinner, right? It in says Canada, up there. We would say we're having fried chicken for dinner, eh? A. Yes. Or we could say right as well. So uh, it also okay. depends on like if you're more city. You U.S. Say, right say ha or too. Hey. Oh, okay. It depends on like I've heard hey, hey, and a. Oh. A hey is kind of I don't using well. hey. I'm saying a. Like hey or, or a. Or the Americans. We're having fried chicken for dinner, hey? Oh. And the Americans like right. I've heard it. It's a very like kind of like stereotypical yeah. thing. That yeah, but Americans don't use it as much as we. I see some like. But some Americans think we use it too much, but we don't. Making kind of fun of it, then I don't. hear it. <laughs> yeah, I hear. I hear a lot of like the a. Yeah, I say a a lot. Yeah, <laughs> I've met some Canadians. I even write it all the oh, time. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, so to perfect. end like it's yes. Synthesizer as well. Exactly. We do that. I write it sometimes too. I'm saying and then I say a at the end. And so that was so cool, eh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Type thing. So it's um, type thing. So we use it as just like an emphasizer yeah. as well. And so I'll type it and it's really hard for me not to use A in those situations. Except for us really like that. Oh, but it's just they, like they should so agree cool. with us, a, you know? A, 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 right? <laughs> right? No, you can say A. You know, if, yeah. I, if I was around more Canadians, mm. I feel like I would pick up and I would say A a lot too. My That's true. My friend, he started picking up A and he was like, it's you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How was it? Well, I think yeah. for me it was a color pencil. For me, it would be the, the, the sofa. Color pencil. Yeah. <laughs> that was that was just like... Pencil crayon we say, bro. I've really never heard about that, you know? Like the pencil crayon was a little different, but I can understand why, but mm. like... Just there's also, <laughs> I yeah. don't know if you have it on here, but um, in Canada we have um, a bunny hug one or area. something or whatever what we have. Call, it goes over your head and it has a, a bunny hug. hug. Uh, you say a bunny like hug. A hoodie. We call it a bunny hug. <gasps> bunny hug. Yes, we say so bunny cute. hug. What? 
That's true. Um, it's from, it was coined in Saskatchewan. It's the, yep. uh, it's the third province in Canada. Uh -huh. Like really central Canada. Okay. And they yeah, made that word. No bunny way. Hug. So I'm so saying bunny hug too. Sometimes, oh, but I'm saying, uh, <laughs> sometimes I'm saying, that yeah. that's super like cute. pull over so two or something. Really Okay, so today we learned some different words with the U.S. and Canada. Let's keep the bunny on. Like this video, we, we use like it. Like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna turn. Bye. I'm gonna. I'm gonna get my uh, bunny hug from the kitchen or something. We say that. That is like that. But hey, guys, thank you for watching. A eh? <laughs> and yes, hopefully you enjoyed. And yes, um. I don't know what to say about, about it was really so just to let you Americans know we use different words uh, you, you heard me too say yeah we use that to say yeah okay she we are using it she's right she was right so yeah hopefully you enjoyed and I will see you guys next time bye everybody